It is Thursday, March 12th, 2020, 2.48 p.m. Um, so I want to talk about one thing, really, but uh, just really quick. The, I started taking vitamin C again, and I've been feeling a little bit better. So I need to look into if it's, like, vitamin C, that, or it's not vitamin C, vitamin D, to see if that's, like, a reason that uh, not taking it might make you depressed or something. But, uh, yeah, I've been feeling better since I started taking it. So still a little depressed, but not definitely not as much as I was before. Like, before, I was, like, really down. So uh, that's been over. So that's, or that's slowly getting over that, which is nice. Um, the one thing I want to talk about right now, just to kind of give an update, um, is the uh, the virus that's around. It's uh, it's scary. It this week in particular, it just bl- like it was always scary, but it, like this this week in particular, it blasted off. Um, it got really really spooky really really quick. Um, it's it's bad. Like Italy has shut down the entire country pretty much. You can't get I believe I believe you can't get in or outs. Uh, people are, are have been told to not go out anywhere. Uh, everything except hospitals and food markets are closed. That are the food markets only open for a few hours. Um, it's crazy. Um, the U.S. just banned uh, trips to Europe for 30 days, excluding the uh, U.K. Um, the NBA postponed its season. The NHL postponed its season. Um, countless things are being canceled south by southwest e3 some big rodeo thing in texas that generates a ton of money um yeah like this is this is this is getting bad like the prime minister of canada's wife is having symptoms she's got tested i don't know what the results are but both he and her prime minister and his wife are being um quarantined tom hanks has it um it's scary dude like i've i've always been Someone who's a little bit, um, at times even, um, more worried about just random things like diseases and stuff and, and thinking I have something when I don't. So like right now I'm just, I'm terrified. Like yesterday I had like a sore throat, but it went away earlier this week. I had a, I think it was a sinus infection. Cause like, um, my nose was really stuffed up. Um, and just, I kept sneezing and stuff. I think I was talking about that. I was, I was sneezing when I was waking up and stuff more than usual. Um, but that cleared up. So that's nice. But like. Right now, I can, I don't know, I feel like, my, it's like a sore throat, but it's also like the kind of sore throat that, it's kind of like that little tingle before I get a cold, so I don't know. Uh, I fought off the cold earlier in the year when literally everyone at work had it, so um, I'm nervous, man. I'm nervous because I'm pretty sure the only way to get tested is to go into like a hospital or whatever and have them do a swab of your mouth, I believe the way it is the way they do it, but it's like, if, even if, if I don't have it, the amount of people I'm exposing myself to doing that is crazy. Um, and yesterday, I, I was lying in bed falling asleep, and I, for the first time ever in my life, I had a debate of the pros and cons of going to the grocery store. Something that I've never thought about, never thought twice about. It's, do I need something? Yeah, I'll go, go get, get something from the grocery store. And it's like, I don't need anything, really. It's just stuff that, like, it'd be nice to have, just, like, food in general. Um, and I was, like, weighing the pros and cons. Like, do I want to do this? Like, it, is this worth, like, obviously it's being dramatic, but, like, is it worth dying for this? Um, so... I, I don't know, man. It's it's crazy, and I, I did end up going to the stores today. Uh, I took with three, which really exposed myself there. Uh, I went to the grocery store that I usually go to for just some Oreos. Um, I really like them. I went to Bulk Barn to get some Jujubes. Really like them, and uh, I went to Walmart to get um, the Reese's eggs that are out for Easter. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm I'm nervous, man. Because apparently it spreads really quick, um, and everyone's obviously you know vulnerable, but especially older people, uh, it can really fuck them up. So I'm worried of get I'm worried about getting it because even if I do get it, like I could die, um, and I could give it to my friends and family, uh, coworkers, whatever, and they could die. Um, but more so, I'm worried just like if 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 I were to get it, like. I, I would I would understand that I can die, but also like, I mean, I'm I'm, I'm relatively healthy I think, so I'd have, I'd have a decent chance. Um, whereas like if my mom or dad got it, they're older, um, and it just that it would decimate them. So um, it's it's making me nervous. And yeah, like I'm getting a whole bunch of notifications that all the po- games postponed. Um, yeah, it's it's crazy, man. It is nuts. Um. And today at work, we had a conversation about it, um, and they said that starting next week, we can start working remotely from home, which is nice, because limits exposure, obviously, and that's coming. Like, it's, I mean, that's that's inevitable. It's going to come 
come to come to come here and it's going to be something that happens <clears throat> in other countries as well like it's italy and i th i forget the other country i want to say i want to say i Af iraq Afgan afghanistan i don't know some <clears throat> somewhere is uh they've shut down the country so <clears throat> i know that's coming and um i imagine it's gonna be coming to the u.s and canada soon um and other countries to follow so it's not it, it honestly it gives me like walking dead vibes it just this spreads so fast and it's like i'm just waiting for for it to get like scary to, in terms of the people's reactions like people are buying out you can't get hand sanitizer or um i think i think uh salt sanitation wipes anywhere um and like I'm just waiting for like there to be something come back in stock and people are going to start fighting over it and they're going to, you know, people are going to say, you know, you, you're only allowed one and it's like, no, I'm taking all of these and they're going to, you know, it's going to start turning into chaos. Like I'm really worried that's going to start happening and it's really going to, you know, show the dark side of humanity uh, as interesting things like this usually do. <clears throat> so that's scary. Um, and yeah, it's just weird. It's weird being like, huh, usually on Fridays I get, I usually on Fridays I get a coffee. Do I want to risk that? I don't know, man. <clears throat> and like now, like clearing my throat, like it's just it's just scary, man. Like I, <clears throat> I'm worried. I'm worried. Um, I was trying to like keep it intact. I was like everyone was saying yeah, before. I was like, you know, it's it, it's not that bad. You know, it's it's still you know relatively new. We're working on it. It's fine. But now it's like this week with all the shit that's been canceling. It's been, it's been um, like like you're really starting to feel it. So. Uh, yeah, I'm just really nervous. Um, and, and the thing also, going back to the work thing, is that they need to... So because I'm on site for this new company on loan, basically, as an IT guy, they need to talk to that manager and figure out what to do. And uh, I was like, so if he says no, like, because a lot of the work that I do can be done remotely, but if he's like, no, I want him on site, what's... I asked him, like, am I at their mercy? Is that, like, is that their call to make? And he's, and Peter's like, no, um, we're going to have to reevaluate everything because... We need to look out after our staff. So that was nice to hear because I was worried that like, all right, everyone can work from home except Michael because he's got to be on site. So <clears throat> yeah, it'll be interesting. Um, and I went to the grocery store today. Also, when I was at the yeah the, the local grocery store that I go to, it was, I hated it so much because there's this guy who like, who's, who's oh, I've seen him before. He was, he was working the register and um uh, I uh, I went up and he just he seemed so like confused so lost like he is like, I don't know how to exp explain it like he was just like not sure what what like he was in a hurry he was like D -d -d should I scan this for I just it was just I don't know it, it was something was going on I don't know if there was something else going on but I also like heard him someone was behind him at some point and he, he was talking to them he's like oh I'm just so dead today and fatigue I believe is one of the symptoms that's like obviously you know he could just be tired obviously I'm I, I'm not trying to be dramatic but like that part of my brain that's like overreacting to everything has always has been that way is like, but what if he has a virus? So apparently it takes like five days for symptoms to show. Um, <clears throat> we'll see, man. We'll see what's going on. Um, yeah. Starting next week, it's going to be working from home. Um, ideally, you know, the entire day and uh, on sites will be, you know, on a mandatory basis or on a need to basis rather. Um, I've got my treats here. Hopefully, none of them are infected. Uh, I risked, I risked it to to get the biscuits, literally. Um, hey, hopefully, everyone's safe, man. I'm 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 really nervous. I'm you know, it's this you know, the last couple of days actually. Just I mean, yesterday in particular was was bad. Like it was, like the NBA postponing. I was like, holy shit. And now I I I. Um, I, I don't I didn't I didn't see the announcement, but everything's getting post postponing NHL. I know the cross league, uh, MLS, everything is all the all the cancellations this week for events. Like it was it was just nuts, man. So um, yeah. If I got uh, if I got infected today, I should be showing symptoms by Tuesday. <laughs> so hopefully not. Uh, Borderlands Three comes out tomorrow. Excited to play that. And, uh, yeah, I, ble I beat Black Mesa, which was fun, and uh, making a video on it. I've, I have, like, two parts probably done that I can uh, uh, post as videos. I've, I've edited all the highlights together. It's about 10 minutes, so I can take out all the non-essential stuff. But, yeah, man, we'll see. 
I'll uh, I'll talk to you when I talk to you. Hopefully next time I talk to you, I'm uh, alive and um, not sick. And no one else that I know of is sick. Um, scary, man. All right, see you.